definitely are. <laughs> definitely lots of buttons going to be pressed on, on both teams, really. <laughs> yeah, all these characters love to hit a few attacks. Uh, I think the general game plan is for, yeah, Diddy Kong to like sort of control center stage and Roy goes for those like heavy hitting uh, kill options. As we see here, you see the... Uh, for sure. Diddy Kong getting that combo on Yoshi there. Nice 63% on Yoshi already. God. Oh, is the duck dead? Oh, not quite. Unless, oh, misses the edge guard a little bit, gets clipped by the egg as recovery. The double down smash. Hitting everyone. No one's safe here. So many off stage happenings right now. And the side There's B. There's a whole mess in the corner. Mm -hmm. Side B at 100%, almost killed the duck actually. Both red team up in the air. Train manages to land. Nitro's still stuck up there. All right, we're back in neutral. Both the blue team looking at a pretty high percent, mm -hmm. which is scary when there's a Roy on the field. Ooh, but the Roy dies first. Unfortunately, does not get the or uh, train does not land the up smash on the duck due to the high percent not connecting the combo. So I mean, duck going to be surviving a little bit longer. All right. Longer. <laughs> and two quick kills coming out from Nitro, putting red team back in the lead. Very, very nice. It is a little bit of a lead, but it's still a lead. Train obviously at high percent, anything can happen. We'll have to see Train's ability to survive. Diddy Kong with a good neutral can be hard to land those killing blows on. Oh, <laughs> honey almost SDing there with the PK Thunder. But does make it back. Train's recoveries have been really <laughs> strange. But they work. <laughs> they, they work. They're, they're hard to matter. catch if you don't know where they're going. Mm -hmm. Oh, up smash doesn't time it properly. Thought Nitro would get out of the egg a bit sooner. PK Thunder's hitting, hitting the duck. A little bit of miscommunication there. Both teams were just kind of work out how to break into each other. And that's the up air, almost killing Train off the top. The fourth throw into the edge guard. What's going to happen here? The up air to catch off of Duck's initial hit. Very, very nice awareness there from Honey. And Nitro going for a lot of these side beats, oh. but none of them are happening to catch the sweet spot. He catches the low recovery from Honey there. Oh, oh the Ness F the smash. Revenge. That's not a move you see hit very often, <laughs> but in the high chaos environment of doubles, you might just be able to sneak one in there. Exactly, exactly. Or throw sending train off stage, goes for that very, very high recovery. What? What's that? You know, I haven't seen him get punished for one of these yet, so. <laughs> exactly. That's probably why he keeps going for it, you know? Don't fix what isn't broken. See Nitro off stage here. Does not get gimped by the nest down air. Would have been very, very bad. For sure. Very, very, uh, still definitely possible for both teams here. Mm -hmm. Honey with that low percent, but, you know, it's nest. You could one gimp recovery is over. And also, the other team has a Roy on it, a character that can kill at a moment's notice. Exactly. If that side B actually happens to hit the sweet spot like it's been mostly failing to do. Like there, I could have sworn that would have sweet spotted, but it didn't. Oh, but did catch the jump though, it seems. So the duck is going to lose that stock. It's definitely looking pretty good for both teams here, <laughs> I guess. Train at high percent. All right, so Train needs to survive. Mm -hmm. And those uh, wacky recoveries could either be the the life or death of, of, of this game for Red Team. And Nitro kind of pulling double duty here, hitting Honey off stage and going to convert off of mm -hmm. Train's initial hit on the duck. I feel like things would be better off for the red team if the percents were reversed and Diddy was the one who was more mm -hmm, able exactly. to take the front because Diddy Kong having because, the stronger neutral. Yeah, exactly, exactly. And then Roy being able to come in only when it's safe to pick up the big hits. Oh goodness. But, you know, one Roy side B, maybe even hitting both players, that'd be a cool clip. <laughs> <laughs> oh! I thought it was about to happen. I know. It's, it's so close. Oh, PK Thunder. Having a little bit of fun here. And let's see, let's see how they convert off of each other. It just goes for the back throw. Okay. Mm -hmm. Goes for the edge guard. Team ledge trapping. Always much harder to deal with than normal ledge trapping. Nitro's still living here. Holds down to get past the ledge. Oh my goodness. Incredibly tricky oh, play B. from Nitro. It doesn't kill. It doesn't kill. Roy side B looking like, oh, um, first. like a way, way weaker move than it's normally considered. This is definitely super intense for both teams here. And that's, the side B. that's finally going to kill. Nitro versus the duck and the and down B. Down the Caught him mashing oh, out of the wow. egg. That was anyone's game at any moment. <laughs> <laughs> that was super, super even throughout, pretty much throughout the entire game, right? Yeah. There was like a little bit of moment where, uh, you know, blue team kind of pulled ahead at the end there, but 
you know, at the end of the day, they still, uh, you know, pulled it out. Going back to PS2 here for game two. Pretty solid stage, especially for doubles. Gives you the space, but, you know, still gives you platforms to convert off of each other. And all that. Train switching to his main of Dark Samus. Ooh. Ho hoping that, um, you know, the character that he's more adept with will prove to work out for him. Maybe went uh, Diddy Kong because Ness has the absorbing. Maybe. That may have been a factor. I but... think he might have just been scared to shoot Nitro. Hmm. With that big charge shot. That it could come from anywhere on the screen. You never know when it might just come blast you. It's a move I've been scared of before in doubles, for sure. Nitro getting these big hits. Yeah, just big hit after big hit, racking up so much percent. Although it is scaling the move, so, you know, might want to you know, go for those nares, go for those forward airs. Unstale the side Bs and all that. Oh, Just wow. like that, see? You unstale the side B and you get the kill for it. Yoshi, a bit of a heavier character, not going to quite die to side Bs there. Oh, but the forward smash! Got the forward smash. Catching the recovery. Very, very nice from Nitro there. Kind of carrying train right now. I don't want to say it, but I'm going to say it. He's been putting in all the work this <laughs> game, really. PK Thunder here. Oh, what? That was a really weird interaction. Oh, unfortunate. Damn, Nitro getting every single kill here, even on his teammates. <laughs> Nitro getting a lot better at landing those side that he's been going for. Mm -hmm, exactly. Kind of Roy's role in this sort of game. It's like, well, you're not always going to be able to stop me, are you? You've got another person <laughs> to worry about. Exactly. Just goes down forward smashing. Train taking oh, a backseat. No! Oh, oh, oh! 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 The double gimp! The reverse gimp! Nitro is dead, but then Honey, unfortunately, upbeat into Nitro. Damn, that very, must have been very like unfortunate. the very beginning of when Ness's upbeat would have gotten, like, like, uh, gone away from hitting. Because, mm -hmm. like, at the very beginning, you know, how it, like, it doesn't go away if you hit someone at the very start? Mm -hmm. I thought it would have still been in that kind of window. But it wasn't. Duck losing that stock there at like 160% or something. And now it's definitely looking like Nitro and Train Show. Mm -hmm. I feel like it's mostly just been like big plays coming up from Nitro that weren't there in game one. Mm -hmm. Although the zoning tools from Train have come in handy to like split them up a little bit. Mm -hmm, for sure. I feel like it's just a character that he knows how to play better, more straightforward. Mm -hmm. Oh, that was such a good conversion from Honey. Whoa, what just happened? What is happening here? <laughs> this is an even stock game now. What? So Honey and Train both got knocked off to the left side there, and Honey went for an up air to kill Train, and then Train came down and just killed Nitro. <laughs> Blue team had control for a little bit. I was thinking they might have been starting to take it back, but they've lost control, and now they're in such a bad spot. This is de it's definitely still very scary, both especially with Blue the rage. Team, both Blue team players at couple percent. One of them dead, and oh. the other one also dead. Yeah, the back air to call out Yoshi's recovery there, breaking the double jump armor. And, you know, Nitro F smashing his way to victory here, taking game two. I'm always happy to see more games like these. This is winner's round one of doubles, and I'm already I'm excited. <laughs> so I think we're going to be just going, going, to be, uh, going back to PS2 here, or the mix-up. What's the play here? Duck Hunt, Smash 4. No. <laughs> Lilac. Windy Hill Zone. What's the option here? Eggdrasil's Altar. Big, big, big Yoshi. <laughs> you love to see it. I know. I've played a doubles uh, game on Super Paper Mario before. Mm -hmm. So we're going to small battlefield here. Uh, small vertical ceiling. I don't know what the plan there is. I guess maybe go for, you know, more up airs and stuff for Ness it and Yoshi. Just, it might just be for the layout. I think, um, because the previous games were played on, um, uh, PS2, and I'm thinking this is the red team's counter pick, and there's a Dark Samus on the other right, team. Right, they right, They might want a smaller stage. Mm -hmm. But I still want, like, the general layout and stuff, right? Yeah. Mm-hmm. And the layout wasn't necessarily the issue. It was, it was how big the stage was and how free the other two were mm -hmm. to reign over it. Down smashes that ledge. Unfortunately, doesn't space it quite properly, but they both, everyone makes it back. The Xenoblade Chronicles 2 medley song playing. Oh no! <laughs> Nitro charging up that forward smash. Oh! Whoa. Speaking of forward smashes, big one there from Train. Oh! oh! Train closing out the stocks. Right. 
And we've got various shifts in momentum all over the stage. People taking mm -hmm. What was that, honey? Well, I guess he didn't take that big of the What the? the shot. Hello? <laughs> I didn't know that's how that worked. Some fancy movement from Train here on the platforms. Very tricky with those uh, bomb maneuver movement areas. Mm -hmm. Really liking these uh, movement options from Train here. Really making his intentions very, very... Uh, what's the word for it? Ambiguous? That's the word. I was yeah. thinking like intentional. No. Well, it is intentional, but You ambiguous. don't want to know the intention. Exactly. Whoa! Switching up his up target. Oh, that's very ambiguous. And Train actually using the bomb to avoid that up smash there. Oh! <laughs> he just Train used wobbling Nitro his teammate. A, no, he just used Nitro as a meat shield. <laughs> but both players on blue team here at very high percents. Really, anything can do is if Nitro F smashes. Wow, red team has a big lead. I haven't been paying too much attention to the scores. Mm -hmm. Although and that's it, ooh, not a clipper F smash, but here. still a still a good hit. And now Duck's gonna take over ledge trapping, but Nitro does escape. Mm -hmm. And Honey gets thrown off stage up against Train. The ball ledge, ledge trapping. Trap. Oh, and he SDs, but clip. Train saves him. I guess he kind of had to though for mm -hmm. the recovery. The side bead, not gonna kill. But it's gonna set up for an edge guard I'm there, surprised he went for that up smash, and it's going to be punished with the next back throw. Mm -hmm. It's either the strongest or second strongest back throw in the game. I think it depends on, like, percents, because if you go high enough, I'm thinking Cineroar's stronger. But, I've, like, at the percents where it kills, I think Ness is stronger. I've heard that Incineroar's kills earlier, like, immediately at the ledge, but then you go any further away, and Ness is, has greater knockback growth. They're both very strong back throws. <laughs> yes. Oh, is actually going to be in a gimp? Can Nitro close this out? Nope. Rolls back to center stage, but gets the side B. Oh! No, unfortunately, he spikes the spikes wrong his person. Teammate. Unfortunate. That's the one way you didn't want it to go. <laughs> they both had the same idea, but it just. <laughs> Nitro was the victim here. So here we go. Everyone's at the ledge here. Very scary situation for uh, Blue Team. Team here. combos? Oh, doesn't quite pick it up. It's a good sandwiching situation. Nitro and Duck duking it out. Both want to kill each other. Oh, the side beam falls out of it. Very, very unfortunate. But wow, the yeah, Duck died. Dies. I didn't even know what he died to. I think it was the same as Dash attack? Oh, that would do it at that percent, yeah. Mm -hmm. So I uh, I think they just have to finish and him off. the charge shot for the back throw. Oh, doesn't he tried to use him as a meat shield again, but Train <laughs> not falling for it. That was it. actually really smart from Honey to not throw there, because if he threw, then he would be vulnerable to get hit by charge shot. So that was yeah. actually really, really good from Honey. But if he doesn't throw, Nitro just stays right there the whole time. Mm -hmm. Hell, I might have even fallen hey. for it if I was Train. And that up smash going to close it out. Nitro and Train taking it 2-1 over Honey and the Duck after Honey and the Duck closed out game one. Looks like that switch to Dark Samus really, really helped a lot.